Welcome back to the channel. My name is Thomas Fletcher and I'm the host of the LCSW Network. If you're new to the channel, please do me a favor by smashing that like button, by subscribing to the channel, and by sharing this video with your social work colleagues and friends. The purpose of this channel is to create a community of hope and support where social workers can come for relevant news, information, and inspiration. Well, welcome back to Self-Care Saturday. Welcome back to week 30 of our 2021 Wellness Challenge Series. So if you're new to this channel, if you're new to this series, I would invite you to watch the previous 29 weeks of self-care topics that we have discussed that we as social workers can use to enhance and improve our well-being. Um, so today's self-care topic, we will be talking about the key recovery concept of education. This topic was developed by Mary Ellen Copeland, um, and uh, I will leave a link to her work and to this in the description box below, but let's just briefly talk about what she means by education. So she says, learn all you can about yourself so you can make good decisions about treatment, lifestyle, career, relationships, living space, leisure time activities, and all aspects of your life. You can educate yourself by attending workshops, lectures, support groups, reviewing educational resources such as articles, books, newsletters. Um, you can talk to other people who have similar experiences and to those who have expertise in this field. And she says, it's also important for us to consider all perspectives and decide which ones feel right for you. So I think education is so important for us. Um, and, and this is not something that's unfamiliar to us. As licensed professionals, continuing education is mandatory for us. It's mandatory for keeping our licenses up. It's also mandatory for us to stay current in our professions. So this is not, a, this is not an unfamiliar topic, but here's where it's different. Whereas we know we need to do continuing education to keep our licenses, to keep our practice up, I think it's just as, just as important for us to keep educating ourselves about self-care practices that we can utilize um, to keep ourselves well as people. All right, so this might not have anything to do with keeping your license up. This has everything to do with maintaining and sustaining ourselves through self-care, right? So one of the things that I like to do for my self-care um, education is watching different types of YouTube videos, you know, where, where I might learn about things outside of mental health, outside of social work practice. I'll give you an example. Educating myself about financial education, you know, preparing myself for retirement and learning about different type of investments things of that nature. That doesn't have anything to do with being a social worker, being a licensed mental health professional, but I think it's important. That's just one example out of many. So again, each of us gets to take that personal responsibility to educate ourselves about whatever we want, you know, any type of, any, anything that has to do with ourselves, whether it's lifestyle, again, whether it's motivation, uh, doesn't matter, you know, uh, we get to educate ourselves about all aspects, all aspects of ourselves. And that's, that's, a, that's a great thing, you know, we get to have fun with it, you know. Um, I, I, and I know many of you consider yourselves to be lifelong learners, you know, so I think it's so important that, that, we, that we embrace that aspect, you know, and go outside of our, our, our field of practice, you know, continue to educate yourself you know, about all kind of things, you know, take an art class, you know, learn about something that's totally outside of your comfort zone. I think that's so important. So I'm going to stop there, guys. But I want to thank you all for watching this video. For all the social workers out there, thank you for the work that you do every day for your clients, for your agency, and for the profession. Please continue to support each other and yourselves. Bye for now.